Barcelona didn't sign Kylian Mbappe, because the truth was that the Catalan club's plan was to sign Erlen Holland? No one expected this. You will see everything in detail now in this video, but first of all I invite you to subscribe to our channel, it's free and you'll receive the main news about the best club in the world. Now that you've signed up, let's get to the news. For weeks Mbappe's name was linked to Barcelona and Real Madrid, but as all the newspapers have already reported, Kylian Mbappe is now practically 100% a merengue player. Given this, this week we were surprised by the news that Manchester City striker, Erling Haaland, was actually Barcelona's main target and is a player extremely desired by President Joan Laporta. After the memorable match this week where Haaland scored five goals as Manchester City defeated Luton Town 6-2 in the Premier League, Haaland was once again the target of speculation in the European market. As we also know, after that match the world of football was surprised by the players' agents who were caught going to meet with Barcelona's sporting director, Deco, and this meeting was precisely to hold a meeting regarding the signing of the player. You must be asking yourself, but with what money will Barcelona sign Holland? Good my friend Kuehler, do you really think that if Barcelona hadn't had a validated plan he would have held this meeting with the players' agents? How Barcelona is at risk of losing its starting center forward Robert Lewandowski, who is in the sights of clubs in Saudi Arabia who are willing to pay millionaire amounts for the player, the Catalan club then wants to sign Holland to take over the Polish striker's place for the next few seasons, mainly due to his young age compared to Lewandowski's. With the money Barcelona sells Lewandowski, the Catalan club will be able to buy Holland and with the player's great image, after all we are talking about the second best player in the world. Barcelona believes that it will have great financial returns through partnerships, box office sales and shirt sales and thus be able to maintain the player's salary. Holland has a very high termination fine, however, it will only be activated from 2025, so this would be the ideal time for Barcelona to sign the player. According to the newspaper AS, to further increase the rumors, Holland would have taken an extremely quick trip to Spain and would have taken the opportunity to visit the Camp Nou and this only raised the hopes of Kuehl's fans even more. To have Holland, Barcelona will very possibly have to get rid of Lewandowski, so in your opinion, which of the two would you prefer to be Barcelona's starting center forward, Holland or Lewandowski? Tell me here and I'll be reading your comment, I'll see you in the next video.